So your sales invoices include the purchase order reference number of the customer, and you want to be showing this on your NetSuite reports. So it will look, for example, like this. So you tried uh, adding the field ID, showing the field ID to know what the field name is, but you're not seeing it. Even though uh, the field IDs are showing for every other fields, it's not showing for the purchase order reference number. So it's quite uh, difficult to find, but I'm just going to cut to the chase and tell you what the name is. So the name is called reference number. If you click on reference number within the transaction table of the, re of the report, okay, it's going to put this transaction number here. I've renamed that column to PO ref number. Uh, for it to make more sense than just uh, reference number. Right, so just move that field where you need it to be and then just save it, run it, and then you'll, you'll be able to see the field value here on your report. Now, don't forget to add this report to your shortcuts so that you don't have to recreate this every time and add the field every time you need to run it. In case you're lost, you can always, always go to Reports, Saved Reports, and then within your saved reports, you should be able to see the report that you created. Okay, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video about NetSuite. Thank you and goodbye.